All right, what's up, everybody out there? Artist of Strong Style here. Here now, the test hands of how the Tri Brigade X Saber deck is. So, hopefully, you guys don't get a little confused because, yeah, the deck can be a little like, you know, you're going to make so many plays where you might get confused of how it is, but hopefully, you don't get confused. All right, so deck, extra deck, field zone, monster zone, spell and trap card zone. Graveyard, Link Zone, and wherever you want to put your Remove from Play Zone. All right, so Book of Moon, Tribigate Vulture, Revolt, a Nervel, a Cerebral, and a Fractal. Okay. Draw. Snatch Steel. Okay. Sometimes I do not expect you're going to draw into Snatch Steel already on your first turn. So let's get on to it then. What we got here. Okay. Always Book of Moon. If you're going first, hell no, you're not going to play Snatch Steel. But first, okay. Discard from your hand to the grave uh, to the graveyard. Send away another Tri Brigade monster. Then you're going to want to send away your kit. And then kit's effect would send away another tribe again. So you want to send away Nerval. Because Nerval, when it's any anytime it is sent to the graveyard, you can search for any tribe again monster and send it to your hand. So I would go Kuras. Now I'm going to go with Kuraz's effect, which is I must send away a Beast beast Warrior or being Wing Beast. So send it to the graveyard. Special summon Kuraz. Cerebral's effect, anytime it is sent to the graveyard, you special summon it. Now Kuraz's effect, banish away... For how many materials you would make of a Tribigate. Tribigate Link Monster. So I'm going to go with Blossom. Now Blossom, you need two. So I'm going to banish away two. So I will banish away my Nervel. And I will banish away my Kit. I'll keep Fractal. So that's to make two. So here's your Blossom. Blossom lets you... Special summon a level four or lower. So, special summon in defense mode because it is a 2000 defensor. Now, Book of Moon you set. Then I'm going to two, three, four, link into a Ominous. Now, in Blossom is sent to the graveyard. I can draw one card, another Nervo. One of these cards must be put back to the grave, uh, put back to the bottom of the deck. I'm going to go with Nervo. Let's put it back. Set the. Yeah, Revolt, keep Snatch Steel in your hand. No need to play right now. Now. Ominous effect is, of course, yeah, you need a link four. So I play, I did do a four. Then, if this card is special summon. Or if another beast, beast warrior, or wing beast monster is special summon to your field, you can banish one card from the field, send it to the graveyard. You can add one. Um, you can add one beast, beast warrior, or wing beast monster from your deck. Add it to your hand. Whose levels or or equal to the number of banished beast, beast warrior, and wing beast monsters you can have 
except for itself. All right, then. So we can go with that. Or so, yeah, first you have a 3000 beat sticker. Now you have Nervo. Whatever it comes down to, your opponent may want to, of course, Ominous, they're going to want to kill, or Nervo, but Nervo's a 2000 defensor. So you have a good defense right there. You have all this face down. Of course, yeah. And if, if opponent declares an attack, book a moon. Because it targets. But if you cannot target it, okay, then you can't target it. <clears throat> then at their end phase, I will revolt, bring back as many as I want to. So one, two. And for my graveyard, if I, for my, if I want to. So that's one, two. Now, I still have two more spots I could put monsters, so I will put my Fractal in defense mode and my Cerebral. Five monsters and my Ominous. Effects are going to be negated, so if Nerva is going to be sent away, this won't go, but at least this one will go in my Cerebral. Then I must make a Try again. <clears throat> Let's see. What do we got? What am I going to make? One, two, three. I'm going to go into making another Ominous. Now, remember, we have to be careful of where you're going to place your... um Where it is. All right, then. So, draw into a Bogar Knight. So, maybe Bogar Knight. Now, if I want to, I can go into a, another Blossom. Or, I can Snatch Steal one of my opponent's monsters. So, for example, let's say you're going against um, Kaiju. So, Snatch Steel, the Kaiju. It comes to you. So, Snatch Steel is to the opponent's Kaiju. Now it becomes yours. Now, here's the thing as well. All right, maybe nothing else. You're just going to have this out. That's really all you can do. So draw, vault. Okay, once again, you have your vault. So yeah, you have a good lineup right here. So then revolt once again. I will bring out a fractal. Whatever it's going to be. Remember, it's going to be negated, but this one will not be negated. So I will go into making a thing. What can you make? <laughs> All right. I can go into a three. So one, two, three. Because, yeah, remember, it has to be so my sheller can be connected to it. Oh, no, my Blossom can. So, my mistake. Let's go into Blossom. So, two. Okay. The Bogar... Um, yeah, the Bogar Knights and my Nervo. Go into Blossom because, yeah, it's, to, it's directly to the Blossom, to my Omen. Nervo. That Nervo was not affected by the... Is not negated, so let's go into a search for a tribe game. Now, okay, let's get a tribe game because that's what Nervel does when it's sent. Draw. Remember, snatch steal. You snatch your opponent's monster. Xavier Airbellum. 
Now remember, the minus of Snatch Steel is that you're going to give your opponent 1,000 life points. Every single standby phase. Maybe then, send away the Fractal. I will get Karaz. Or, you know, it could be any, because even if you're going to special summon, you don't got that much room anymore to make anything. So let's just get what they, let's just get a regular. Or you could go Fractal. Yeah, let's go Fractal. Okay, send away. No, not Fractal then, because I send that away. Then let's just get a nerve out then. So then maybe just, yeah, okay. Now, Xavier Ebellum, you are going to link into another four. And maybe you're going to have three now. Ominous. Then Blossom, draw a card. One must go to the graveyard. So I would just throw away Voltro because you do not have any more X Sabres on the field. So when it comes to your end of your turn, again, you know, if you still have it, snatch you, you're gonna give your opponent a thousand life points, but with so much damage you're gonna give to your opponent. It's not gonna be so much if you're gonna give your opponent life points. And then, okay, just an extra, extra x of Voltro. And then just, yeah, you, you see the idea right there of how I'm doing this? So, yeah, we're going to go again. This was just that one turn of what I was doing. And then, yeah, what Snatch Steel does, you're going to snatch your opponent's monster. And what I mean by Snatch Steel, you snatch even a Link monster if you wanted to. You can snatch away any monster. So no matter what it is. Even if you want to, you can snatch an Egyptian God card and put it to your side of the field. You can snatch them. You know, the Red Dragon Archfiend engine, you know, they're going to make this Super Red Nova uh, Dragon. No, you can snatch it. Snatch a Kaiju like I just showed you. Snatch a Judgment Dragon, except the minus is, yeah, you're going to have to send away the top four cards. All right. Cerebro. Rescue Cat. Tanky. Xavier Airbellum. All right, then, so... And then let's see. Another tanky. Okay. You got a good option right there. If you're going first, okay. Tanky, you would go first. Search for a. Let me see what you got. You can go for rather Tribrigate Fractal or X Saber. Bogar Knight. Let's go Bogar Knight. Let's say Rescue Cat is first you're going to want to go with. Then distribute it. Air Bellum. And 
Island. Tack så. You're gonna synchro to make a level six, and then yes, here you go. Yak saber. Honey. Let's put that to the top of the deck because we know at the end phase you're gonna search for a X saber. Now let's just set the Walter, okay, end phase. Now you can send it to the graveyard because you know you're gonna search for an X saber. Now what X saber you're possibly gonna choose? Well then I'm gonna go with since I got a good option right there, I'm gonna go for Walter. Well then, okay. Another formation. Now you're gonna go for your fractal this time. Now first, Bogar Knight. Bogar Knight lets you special su uh, special summon. So, Airbellum. When I have two X Sabers, I can special summon Voltro. Voltro lets me special summon one from my from my graveyard. Dark Soul. I'm gonna send away Fractal. To get a, well, to send away my mistake, send away to the graveyard. Send away a kit. Kit's effect lets me throw away another. So, my mistake. Let's go for. And then I will search for. Nerva lets me search for a trap again. Synchro. Oh, my mistake. Now I will synchro for a nine, which lets me bring out X Saber Gotsons. Now, I got more options I can do. Let's go for Link. Let's put that to the top because we know that's going to be a... And let's go with... Oof, what do we got? All right, we'll go with Blossom. Now, okay. Remember now, since, you know, there's no points. But what I can do is discard to special summon Caress. Special summon to the spell and trap card zone. Well, sent away to the graveyard, special summon. Kuraz lets me send away, banish. Why well, would go first? Okay, you can do the effect of banishing because it's going to let you do that. So uh, instead, I'm just going to, here we go, into a ominous blossom goes. So, okay, we know still you're going to search for an X saber. So I will draw a card. One of these cards must be thrown back to the bottom of the deck. 
So let's go kit. Bottom of the deck. So then, let's see. What else can we do? I will keep it from there. Oh, wait, no, I did have, I forgot, I did have. So, Tri Brigade Vulture, Revolt. Now, Special Summon. Special Summon. And Special Summon. Effects are going to be negated. So let's go one. That counts as three. Four. And so another Ominous. End my turn, but remember, I did use Dark Soul, so I will search for another X Saber. Well, show. Draw into a another Vulture, I guess. All right. Well, Dark Soul. I have two X-Sabers, since, you know, I guess they were not destroyed. Special Summon Voltro, since I have two. Special Summon one. Special Summon an X-Saber. All right, maybe Arabellum. Now, I have... Now, I, I have this huge lineup. Wow, it's just huge. I could possibly do Gotham's effect, which is I can tribute one to take away one one of my opponent's monsters, one of my opponent's cards from their hand to the graveyard. Now that was just special summoning. I didn't even normal summon. So let's go to a normal summon. If I wish to keep that, I can, or I can make another Blossom. Remember, connected, connected. This is connected, so that works. I can special summon another. Yeah, there you go, special summon, because it lets me special summon one. Or I can keep it in my hand, because let's say Blossom. Remember, if Blossom goes... I'm going to draw one card. So I'll keep this in my hand. End my turn, but Dark Soul was thrown away. I search for an X Saber. I'm going to get Ragnarok. Now, here's the reason why I'm doing that. Draw, rescue cat, normal summon. Now, when this card is normal summon or special summon, I can add one X Saber. X Saber, okay. Back to my hand. Voltro. Then, let's go into a link. All right, let's just say we'll go into a sh uh, Cheryl. A Ramper, my mistake. Okay, Blossom was thrown in, so draw one card. Discard one card. So let's just say the Nerva. We'll throw away the Nerva. Two X Savers. Special Summon. Just look at this. Look at what you're doing. It's just fun. See, yeah, I, I don't like to link... But with linking with this deck, it just makes it more fun. If I were to just play normal, it would just be making just these simple ones. But if you can do more consistent plays, yeah, I just made so many plays just in this one turn.
if I didn't if I did not have the tri brigades, it would just be like this simple right here. But look how much more you can make. Look how much you can do. And it makes it more fun. See, I like to play for fun, and this is how fun I can be with this deck. I can do so much more, and it makes it more fun. Yeah, I admit, I don't, li I don't like to link. But if you're going to have some more fun, which I do want to do, I would, I, I would want to play the deck, play a deck with so much consistent of playing for fun. Not competitive, but for fun. And look how many things I just did just in one turn. I just did so many. So yeah, Link, Tri Brigade, and then using it with the X Savers. And then yeah, a simple, you know, everyone possibly knows it, but yeah, when you snatch steel, it becomes yours. It becomes yours, but then each standby phase, you're gonna give your opponent a thousand life points. So that was like a test hand. So you can see how the deck is played. So if you didn't get confused of you know me describing of how, about the deck profile, well, at least you saw of how the deck is played then when I described about what I was talking about. So <clears throat> that was the test hands of a tri brigade X Saver deck. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Like, comment, subscribe. I will speak to y'all later. More decks coming later, and I will do test test um, test hands for you guys. Speak to y'all later. Peace.